Oh, this game is amazing, you guys gotta check this one out. Man, is it cool. All right, so here we have Particle Blast by Lorelei DeBest. Now, I can see in the instructions here, I absolutely have to, big huge warning, if I've never played this game before, make sure you click on the help button inside the game to figure out how to play it. I'm an expert though, I've played this game before, I'm ready to go. The premise of the game is you have to hover your mouse over the particles that you need and then hit space to destroy them. And we need to destroy the correct one. So let's go ahead and jump in. Settings, ooh, I love this start screen. The animations coming into it looks really good. And all the colors are cohesive. Very professional look right off the bat on just this start screen. Let's go ahead and play. And the music is killer, I love this music. All right, so, three, two, one. Go! Ooh, I like that little sound effect there. All right, so destroy all the particles needed for photosynthesis. So we're looking at light energy, some water, and some carbon dioxide. All right, so water. Ooh, I like that. Oh yeah, sound effect, that's really cool. I was like, I don't need glucose. I need some light energy though. Let's go ahead and, ooh, already to the next level, nice! All right, so destroy all the particles that are produced during cellular respiration. All right, it's been way too long since I've done biology. I'm a computer scientist after all. I am a massive nerd though, so maybe I can get this right. I don't need glucose, I need water, ATP, light energy. Okay, so ATP and water, I think we're going after. Uh, ATP, um, so even though I didn't know these things, because I was able to uh, hear the sound effects, I was able to figure out exactly what I needed really quickly. Uh, even though I'm not clicking any of the right things anymore. This is really cool, time up, game over. Click the green flag to play again. Awesome background music for the game over as well. My final score was five, the high score is 138. Man, I'm so bad at this game, but this game is really good. The high score feature, the global high score, the cloud variables here are incredible, super useful here because it feels like you're part of a community. You're not just sitting here playing the game on your own. All together, it was super polished lower light. This is really good. I really liked this game. All right, here we have Merry Hacksmas by iGalaxyYT. Maybe iGalaxy is his YouTube channel. Maybe check him out, I don't know, or her. I don't know, it's iGalaxy. All right, so click on the Hacking News logo to get clicks. Click the shop to shop, that makes sense. And then click the back button to go back to the main screen. All right, that's all pretty self-explanatory. Ooh, you can even hit save to save your data and actually save your score so the next time you come in, you can uh, start right back where you left off. All right, let's get into the game here. Hit the green flag. Um, ooh, I like the music. It's Christmassy, which is important because, well, it's a hack miss. Um, oh, and when I click, the, all the presents don't go until I actually start clicking. That's a nice touch. It makes it so that I'm not just clicking a static image to make a number go up. There's some interactivity there, which is really cool, including the growing of the logo is really nice. Let's go ahead and get into the shop. Let's see if I can buy anything. Ooh, I can buy a clickers for 50 clicks. Let's go ahead and buy that one. And it grays it out. That's a super nice touch. All right, let's go ahead and go back here. And you can see the presents start falling because it's an auto clicker. My score's going up on its own. I really like the polish on this and the unique artwork. There's some originality, a little bit to this, but not too much because it is just a clicker. But the fact that they did the artwork themselves and they had this hand-drawn hat kind of matches the hand-drawn um, title here, Hacksmith. It's really cool. And the presents and everything, the artwork looks really good. I think there's a few things to change here and there. Um, but altogether, it's a pretty cohesive game. I really like the music and the, the feel of it, and it's 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 got some addictiveness. It's really cool. iGalaxy YT, pretty cool. You got you guys should check this one out. See if you can see what score you can get to. Probably four trillion because they'll just leave it running in the background while you go. I don't know, play Minecraft or whatever you kids do nowadays. Oh, <laughs> this one's called Shooty Shooty by Epic Toast 1868. So I'm assuming he's not born in 1868. That would make him almost as old as I am. But we got click to shoot. That's pretty easy. All right, let's go ahead and hit the green flag. Hit the play button. I like the start screen there. That's cool. Bullet, bullet, bullet. Enemy, no enemy. Got it. <laughs> this is cool. All right, so there is a few things right off the bat that I'm really noticing that I'm really liking is that the, um, well, the sprites for the bullets and the enemies are just the word bullet and enemy, which is really cool. And I can shoot as many times as I want. There's not really a delay there. Um, it makes, I died already. All right, let's go ahead and try that again. Um, the only thing that's missing, there's no sound effects. I would really love some music or some sound or something like that in the background. Just kind of keep me um, a little bit more entertained while I'm playing this game, even though this game is a lot of fun. I love the artwork here. Um, the backdrops are cool. I would also like to see some sort of, uh, <laughs> this is just ridiculous. Um, some sort of like countdown. This is how many clicks I need to get to the next level or some sort of life 
counter or something like that so I know when I die. The game over screen also doesn't fire all the time. That's probably my fault though, not yours. This is really cool though, Epic Toast. I, I just, I like that it's silly. <laughs> it's cool. Here we have Egg Wars by Sean C. Hackington. All right, it's a Hackington student. So we've got press A to fire an egg from the rooster, press L to fire from the chicken. All right, so they go back and forth, they shoot each other. And then W and S to go up and down and up and down arrows to go up and down the other. So it's a two player game. So I'll go ahead and I'll bring in a second person to when I actually judge this game. This is just a first impressions here. Um, so A, 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 not caps lock, A. <laughs> He poops the egg. <laughs> oh, and the egg actually appears. The egg splats appear on the other character. That's an awesome touch. The costume changes based on the number of times you've been hit. And when you get to a certain score on this, yeah, the rooster won. All right, let's try that again. Let's play that again. Let me chest out the movement here. Okay, so the movement isn't perfect. It's not really smooth. You can't exactly dodge the eggs because the movement isn't quite fast enough. Um, like if I'm just controlling the rooster and I see that egg coming, there is no way I can dodge it in time. You just move too slow unless I'm already out of the way of the egg. <laughs> but the individual costumes, the hand-drawn art, I mean hand-drawn art, that's cool. The overall concept of this game is relatively original. I've seen some games that are shooting back and forth like that, but the fact that it's roosters and chickens and eggs and all that is fun and silly and it's addictive because I just, well, I'm playing my friend and I want to beat the snot out of them. I want to just cover them in eggs. So I want to go over and over again. You throw down wagers, you start arguing with your friends on who's better. This is pretty cool. I'm really digging this one. The winner this week is Particle Blast by Lorelei the Best. Awesome job combining actual science knowledge with amazing gameplay. The sound effects that she included and the music totally set her over the top. Amazing job, Lorelai. Check your Scratch inbox for your prize. And yes, we do have prizes. So if you want to enter your game to possibly win a prize and be featured in the next episode, go ahead and head over to hackingtons.com slash scratch. The link is in the description. Head over there and submit your project, fill out the form, and you could possibly win an awesome prize and be featured on the video. And of course, if you wanna learn how to build these amazing games, head over to hackingtons.com. Sign up for the free trial class, check out our Scratch curriculum. We have a ton of stuff in there. We teach you how to build the most amazing and best Scratch games. You build like 40 projects and each one is better than the one before, so check that out. And of course, like the video, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell for notifications, all that garbage that YouTubers tell you to do at the end of the videos. But most importantly for us here at Hackingtons, build something amazing.